Well, today I'm absolutely ginormous. I should stand on the side. Today I'm an absolutely ginormous version of myself, but these are the pots we're going to be doing, so. Good morning, Chili Dogs. What'd you focus on? Grows. Literally, I've grown. Feed them horses. We're going to get into these pots. It's going to be pots, soon to be pots. I'll see you over there in a second. Green off. Apple. <laughs> Hello, everybody. We're back again with another Pottery Demon review. Let's get into it here. We'll start off with the one over here. I think that this one is the most basic one of the day, but you know, every once in a while, I gotta make one of those uniform looking ones. And so I think this one is not totally uniform, but it's a lot more uniform than the other ones. So I think it's good contextual information for the other two pots, right? Then we're gonna hop over to here. So I like this one quite a bit. This one I think is kind of like, um, it's a buffer tree, so I have this buffer on the base and that top. I think the top is a little bit too squatty. I think it would have been cooler if I could have got a little bit more height, if I would have got rid of one of those little twists on the bottom there. But it's kind of cool when the tree starts collapsing in on itself, collapsing those, it's almost like a slinky or spring on that bottom. So I do think that's kind of interesting. I just wish that that tree top was a little bit taller. I have some little tandrils trying to bridge that gap between the buffer and the tree there. So kind of like what's happening in this spot. And then on the top, oh. This one's probably, this is the first one we did. It was a lot looser, but I do think that this one kind of looks, uh, I don't know, I think it looks pretty interesting. It kind of gives me this like pose like this, you know? It's kind of like that, right? Hold on. Is it the other hand? Like this. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. All the best. Strong mentality. See you in the next one. Green off.